that mean? I'm gonna ask somebody who used it. I have to keep them locked up simply because they make a noise if you don't. Uh, of course, look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at even, where is it from? Uh, I don't know, I, I bought that from a, uh, one of the high class antique dealers. He was finally selling his, I forgot what, what the American name is that. Can you read that? Mm -hmm. I don't have my glass, I'm holding the lid. Oh goodness, it just says, uh, uh, is it Lennox? Um, yeah, Lennox. Okay. That's the American equivalent of Balik, which is Irish. Mm -hmm. And Oh, I have the information on it too in here. I oh, wrote yeah. But I just love it. And because I loved it so, there was another lady who wanted it. Mm -hmm. Another deal. We were friends. And she said, you love it, you get it. Oh, <laughs> nice. And, there's the swan. There's the swan, yeah. And then, Diane had one of those. I mean, Denise had one of those. And then there's, there's this little one, too, that came from it. And, uh, and it there's the plates back mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. And I don't use them. I used to use them a lot on the buffet. Mm -hmm. I, you know. And they are swans ones. Ah. Um, if you poke the table, the... Mm -hmm. Uh, things out of the way. This is an unusual one. It's a technique that's very strange. It kind of blows up in the kiln hmm. and makes these things. Hmm. And so it's the, heavy. Uh, it's like almost stonework. Yeah. There's my one shot for modern, <laughs> and I loved it. I went by and I said, "You're the ugliest thing that I ever seen, and I love you." <laughs> and take a look at it. it it really grows on you. Oh. I used to put those out a lot. In the okay, summer. yes. So this is the same um, style? The same, uh, same style. Technique? No, this is no. a different technique. Oh. Yeah, this is one where it's very unusual. Well, this is pretty unusual to have this on the side like that. Uh, wow. I think this on uh, swirled on. It's not raku, but it's somewhat like Want it. me to put that back up? Mm. Yes, please. A little bit of dust there. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. There you go. Now you can see the... Um, plates a bit. Oh uh, yeah. Maybe Tom could get one down. But Can see, you reach the... So, they're so pretty because they... The Designed exclusively for Royal Rooster. And... Should I turn it over? <laughs> and I put... When I put those up, I put the swan stuff out. Oh, this is gorgeous. And there were a whole set of them, but you know, I couldn't use a whole set. Mm -hmm. So I only bought the two that I kind of liked. Mm -hmm. Cottage gardens and villages. But I don't use them anymore because they're up, as I said, they're up there and I'm down here. Mm -hmm. And I remember this one. Oh, Aren't they my little dorables? Oh, yes. What is the name of that, um, it's Pot, no, what was her name? The, um... Beatrice Potter? Be Potters, Beatrice, yeah. yes, Potter, yes. She did such realistic, I mean, they're humanized, but they're very realistic. Mm -hmm. And there was a documentary on her where they used live actors, and it actually used a little live mouse running across, <laughs> and her, you know, you know, there was a, something recently about her, and I can't remember, but it was about the fact that she actually um, did a, um, a lot of study of the, oh, yes. the animals. Oh, yes. Um, to, um, That's what I said. Yes. This may look humanized, mm -hmm, of course. but the details, the ears, mm -hmm. the eyes, the whiskers, mm -hmm. uh, is all very mm -hmm. authentic. Mm -hmm. Like this, this one here. And look at now. Look at the way the uh, oh, the that's chills. So sweet. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And she was a a, natu a naturalist. Yes, that's what definitely. And her, her some of her books are, are exquisite drawings. Mm hmm Now this is the Irish Lennox. Mm hmm And mm -hmm. this is a. It's devalued now. 
mm. from what we used to buy. I bought it quite a while. <laughs> Devalued? Yeah, in other words, they don't have the value that was, mm. that people, uh, and it just breaks people's heart because they know when de the value goes down, people throw them away. Mm. When things are expensive, they don't throw them away. Right. So a lot of beautiful pottery is being destroyed. Hmm. And, and also pe now people this don't one, have room for Now them. this one is one of the, that one is quite old. This is really an ancient one. Hmm. I can't read it, but maybe you can read the thing on it. Um, okay, let's see. Um, it says Lotusware Jug and Worn Rim and bought from Erwin Holtzman for a hundred dollars yeah. um, in 2007. That's what it says. Yeah, well, else uh, uh, this was the, the gold is worn off of it because, somewhat because it was used. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Used all the time. But this one is really old. Mm -hmm. So is that one too. Mm -hmm. Let's get this back in there. What I like about this is what I bought was it for the detail. I love the little curve, mm -hmm. the little handle, mm -hmm. and and then that one over there is real. And the weave. <laughs> that one is real old. Mm -hmm. Old um, Art Deco type thing, and um, the pattern. I used to know all the history of them. The pattern, the gold. That's now these. These are wild. Those are new. Ah. Uh, they are done. That's right, like raku. Mm hmm Take a look on the inside. Wow. Oh yes, you gave me a raku bowl. Yeah. Yes. I love the I love those. These come out in the fall. These come out in the fall. Mm -hmm. uh, and, uh, and these came out like in spring. Mm -hmm. These came usually at Easter. Mm -hmm. And these never came out much, but I love the blue, and that's Russian. Mm. Are these a match, this one and this one? They are somewhat similar. Yeah, they look similar, but not a match. Yeah. And this and one, this one, this one of all places they got in Big Rapids, Michigan. Hmm. I looked all over for a Russian teapot because they were all big ones, mm. big, a big family. Mm -hmm. And I wanted a small one so I could use it. And I'm going on a, one of the senior trips, and they're going to a shop in Big Rapids. They're all going, you know, let's find some tourist stuff. And in one corner, she had. Uh, beautiful dinnerware and stuff. And they're sitting with a teapot. <laughs> and I go, ah! <laughs> everybody says, what's the matter? I said, a Russian teapot. And it was. Uh -huh. <laughs> I carried that all the way back home on a bus, all wrapped up solid so it would. And then these I got at uh, antique shows. Mm -hmm. and this one you see is, is got this in there, which just makes it a little more ex expensive. I forgot to take the tag off of that one. That was probably my last acquisition. I stopped when um, Joni died. Mm -hmm. I just didn't. You didn't have someone to share it with. Well, she taught me. Mm -hmm. She taught me all the things. I'm going to put these back. Yeah. Uh, they're kind of iffy to get back in because those holders. You really need to get a step yeah. stool. Well, I think I can reach. Can you see where? Do you want this one here or the one? Doesn't in the matter. Corner? Just get them in there, back in. Okay. Yes, yeah, so that one's in As there. As I said, the holders are iffy. I'm gonna put They're not. this down there for a minute. Mm. Wide. Let me see if I can get you. This is how the darn thing. That's better. They're pretty, but <laughs> now you see why I have them at, had them at an angle. Yeah. <laughs> Fit yeah. in. Yeah. They're all arranged nicely one time, and then mm. I just, you know, you, you just stick them back up anywhere you can get them and shove them in. Okay. This was up here, right? It doesn't matter where because okay. And I don't where care. does the, this one go? The, Same just, place. Yeah, okay. just stick it up. Okay. And I think this this one. Oh, that one. Push the big one back. That one over here. Huh? 
Right here, this little one. This little one. Little oh. jug. Oh, okay. The other, that one was bought at the big pottery show. Mm. This was bought at, um, they came to an, a, a man came, the potter himself, came and explained that one. And there's a Chinese one back here. Uh, that, one? that one was at an estate sale. Mm-hmm. And nobody wanted it, and I had my eye on it. <laughs> oh, you lucked out. And no, for some reason, nobody wanted it. Uh -huh. And I said, that's for me. Mm -hmm. But you, you're not allowed professionally to buy anything ahead of the game. You have to wait till the show, you know, the mm -hmm. stage game is over. Mm -hmm. And so there it was sitting, and there I oh, was smiling. Yeah. Oh, I got it. <laughs> yeah, that is very nice. Lots of beautiful yeah. detail. Yeah. How, I do, think, how do they get the design on there? Uh, that is, because it looks, they put the outline on it, and then the coloring goes. They put the coloring on top of. It. It's yeah. like if you feel it, because you can like, feel it's raised, it. Yeah, yeah. It's like cloisonne. Okay. I have a couple of pe little pieces that your sister gave me, not Denise. Uh, Diane. Diane. When she was in uh, Japan. Yeah, mm -hmm. or not Japan, Okinawa. Okinawa, yeah. And uh, you can have those because they're small if you want them. They're they're very pretty little pieces. Mm -hmm. But you just, uh, I have them on my knick-knack shelf. Mm -hmm. uh, this is one of my favorites too. I don't know why, mm -hmm. but I love this thistle pattern. Oh, yes. This doesn't belong with it. Mm -hmm. But these are genuine thistle. Um, Scottish ones, mm -hmm. and my little, I love my little egg cups. I have a whole bunch of little egg cups. But I love that thistle pattern. I don't know why it's delicate. Uh -huh. And um, I used to use a teacup. Mm -hmm. I used to use all my teacups, but I'm in the place now where I'm eating off a of paper plate so I don't have to wash dishes, you know? I mean, yes. you're, you're getting pretty this. low when you start doing that. You know, Tom and I like to see thistle in the parks because um, uh, the finches like it yeah. and the butterflies like the flower. Um, but uh, most of them have been introduced by humans that are from Europe or yeah. Asia. So um, there's this thing where like, oh, rip them all out, you mm -hmm. know, like at the Selby farm, they're like mm -hmm. ripping out the thistle. If he, if and he, I'm like, well, but this is a beneficial plant, you know, um, so. I just, I just love it. And they said, I, I used, to, used to use the cups out of here as well as the ones out of the cupboard. Mm -hmm. But as I said, it's rare. Usually it's on a holiday or when, whenever I'm feeling low, I do something like make a good pot of tea with all the good stuff, you know? <laughs> yes. This is, uh, let's see. To get the genuine thistle pattern is hard. Yeah, this is made in England. I made a mistake of giving a, one of my thistle cups to someone who really wanted a thistle cup. Mm -hmm. And looked for years and so, yeah. And I just thought she had to have it. Mm -hmm. And I gave it to her. And I only had the little one then. And I looked for years. I couldn't ever find one. And there was right next to where I do my hair now. Uh -huh. There's an antique mall. Uh -huh. uh, and they have odd antiques there of some different kind. And I was walking in there with someone. I don't know who was showing it off. There's and there was a thistle cup. Oh. <laughs> and it was that one. And it was genuine. Uh -huh. So you were able to get it back. I know. Uh, Anne said, I said I had the genuine ones and I had them from, oh no you didn't, blah, 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 blah. And I said, oh yes, she said, they, they, I gave them to you. And I said, no you didn't, those were given to me by mom and May. And it might even been one from you, your mm -hmm. mother. Mm. Although she was more on the um, flowers, hummels. Oh, yes, yes. And so she got the hummel ones.